There is clearly something wrong with YouTube here. Look, the official Evanescence channel, right? Posted 12 years ago, 1 billion views. Oh. Shit, I made a mistake. My bad. I thought that was 18 views. Look at my laptop screen. Oh, I thought it was only 18 views. I failed. I thought that I found something really messed up. Ah, silly me. Hopefully nobody's blinded because this is silver. This is the back. I'm not going to show you the front because it has shown as a dress on. I hope this makes it. Goodbye. Uh, right, 4.30 pick up today as it is Monday. Such fun, eh? You will see what's in that package when it reaches pretty much the other side of the planet from here and that would be Tasmania Once upon a time I knew this very cute girl she had an awesome Geordie accent but when she got angry she's like give her the spoon back now ah fuck off you mackin nobody gives a shit about you from the mines, the docks, the shipyards, and the pits. It was a big river, and it was mine. But that stupid bitch took it all. Fucking Thatcher. I was one of the first few people, if not the first person, to say, Ding Dong, the witch is dead. Or rather, Ding Dong, the bitch is dead. I remember finding out on that day that that stupid fucking cow died. And we've been trying to rebuild this, the best town ever, South Shields. We've been trying to rebuild this. Since that time, it's a hell of a long, hell of a hard, hell of a journey, but we're going to make this town great again. Those Jarrah lads might seem like absolute chobas, but they're actually hard working lads. Fuck the bullshit. Punk unites us all. This is not my punk style by the way, I, I just have sense of eyes. I'm not trying to look cool. I just wear whatever the hell I want. And wear useful things. And there's too many bright colours outside. Looking at both these glasses there. It's blinding to me. That's just my issue. Nothing to do with punk at all. I know quite a few people whose birthday it is today, the 14th of March. Let me think, was that before or 
one two or three days after. Let's just say 20 years ago to the day. I know where I was. I was in a leisure centre. Trampolining! Wow, 20 years ago. That leisure centre is no longer there. The Temple Park Leisure Centre. Oh. Ah. Was that a dream I had? Or is there actually a video in YouTube? Of what that place was like. I'm going to have to find out. But I'm not going to put that into this video. So, as you can tell, no sunglasses. I have the blind thing. Blind or blinds down. You know, it's just like one blind foldy thing. I'm still sensitive to the light coming through the sides of the bloody thing. So, anyway. Happy birthday to whoever the bloody hell's birthday it is today. I doubt she will watch it. Elizabeth. I highly doubt you watch my videos. It'll be bloody awesome to hear from you again. Crazy memories I have. Maybe a bit too overwhelming for me, so... Nah, I've said enough already. And it's one of my uncle's birthdays as well. So... Well, I'm not going to say his name, but... Happy birthday, uncle. I hope everything's okay, because I haven't heard from you for over a year now, maybe? And he didn't send me a happy birthday message on my birthday, so... For half. Nah, I love every member of my family. Even though we're all arseholes to each other. Sometimes. It's all certainly forgivable. The name, Punk, does give quite a bit of stigma because people think it means something and it certainly doesn't fucking mean that. If you disagree with Punk, you're disagreeing with everything positive like trying to get things sorted out trying to make people's lives better even though personally I don't know what's happening like if once you're dead you're dead then that's it punk would be more suited to the belief in something after your so called pass away I've been struggling with that personally. But anyway, back to the whole stigma and judgement. You think punks have problems? If you're thinking like that, then it's you with the problem. How else can I put this? This pendant thing just showed up on my floor. I bought this for somebody. Um, over three years ago. And it's just shown up. Ah. I really don't know where the hell this thing came from. It was just on my floor. Strange. A lot of people are having issues with communications, basically. With the whole YouTube connection thing. And this is because, to my belief anyway, the 
recent solar flare coming from our sun in our solar system our main star so that's what's causing all of the problems not many people know this and people are just wondering like okay why the fucking hell is nobody joining my live stream i can say viewers and then the viewers suddenly go it's all just this kind of solar energy thing that's messing things up so there is your answer you know the gig that i said i was expecting a ticket in the post for well it arrived yesterday Ta -da! So this came from Sea Tickets in Nottingham. Cool. I've checked out over the last few days, by the way. <coughs> I've checked out the three bands that are playing that gig, and I'm really impressed. I'm really looking forward to this gig. A show. A concert or performances or event some Americans that I know of don't seem to understand what a gig is so it's all of those words and many more yeah, it's gonna be a good night out Punk all the way. In memory of Menzi, who passed away because of COVID. And I, by the way, I haven't been to a gig for years now. I've recorded a lot over the years and put my videos in YouTube of gigs I've been to. Maybe someday I'll get round to making a big compilation of everything that I still have available of gigs over my various YouTube channels. It'll be nice to see them all in one place. I'm losing my voice because I've been on the phone to a friend for something like, I think it was close to 12 hours yesterday. So yep, my voice is gone. <clears throat> One final note that I found hilarious when I was on the phone yesterday. It's not so funny today, but I think I had too much soda to pop. You know, it's sugar free. I still started getting really giddy. Oh well. This is what I found hilarious yesterday, so I'll leave you with this. If it doesn't fit in, which way am I saying this? If it doesn't fit in your mouth, you shouldn't put it in your ass. Okay? That's something good to live by. <laughs>